Hey friends, it's Lisa. Welcome to another episode of My Horizontal Plans, where I am just trying to give some representation to the black sheep of the planner layouts. So I am changing it up this week. I am not planning in my Erin Condren horizontal. I should say I'm not truly decorating in my Erin Condren horizontal. I'm actually decorating in my Moxie Life horizontal. You may know about the Moxie Life Planner. This is a new planner that came out starting for the 2020 calendar year. And it's a goal setting planner. And it comes currently in two different layouts, vertical and horizontal. And then there's two color choices in terms of the, the cover. So I have the yellow. This isn't a review or anything. Um, but I really like this planner. I have been using it for my goals. I will say with uh, COVID, I haven't really been doing many goal tracking activities because I've just been living. <laughs> so yeah, so today I'm going to be decorating with the Oh Hello kit that I got recently and I will put in a card up above the video where I went through these, but this is their Llama weekly kit. I don't usually use weekly kits, but I, I saw this. I really like it. And the reason why I want to use it this week is because if everything goes all right with my work day on Wednesday, come 4.30, if I'm not working, I want to attend an, a virtual online alpaca farm tour that my friend linked on Facebook to me thought it would be something that I'm interested in. I'm very interested in. So I am going to be decorating with this kit in the spirit of the alpacas and the llamas that I hope to see on Wednesday. Oops. I think it was meant for children, but it's inviting all ages. And you know what? I'm in all ages. So I actually don't have a lot of, of these stickers, sticky notes. I actually have a little pad here that has some of the things that I need. So I'm first going to take these washi tapes that I have, I don't have that much, especially the yellow, um, but I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to break down my days. literally made the end of it which sucks because oh boy I don't have any adhesive tape cap sucks seriously um if you watch my other plan with me I have I still don't have adhesive tape adhesive rollers or anything oh All right, change of plans. So I haven't bought adhesive tape because it's not an essential item, although maybe I really should make a, uh, an online order either to Michael's or Amazon and throw adhesive tape in there. Um, crap. All right, so I'm gonna switch it up and I'm gonna use this green washi, which is a little bit thicker, but still kind of. And if this washi doesn't make it to the end, I'm going to be so mad at myself. The good news is I feel pretty good that I actually am using up my washi and stuff. Okay. All right. That's what we're doing. It looks yellow on camera, but it's actually that's like a neon green. <sighs> All right. So I'm going to put this here. All 
I am not putting them in any particular place, but let's see. Okay. Ooh, there's a small yay, it's payday, which I actually do have payday on Wednesday, so that's fun. I don't know with these stickers what if I can what type of pen I can use on them. Some pens when you use stickers like Chrissy Ann designs, it's very smeary. So um let's see. I'm gonna be using a pilot G2 seven point whatever. Um and I'm going to put, I have a lot of stuff, oh, man, okay, it's fine. Ah, dinner, got cut off, mofo, oh, and that's yellow on yellow, ugh, girl, you did not visualize that in your head at all, okay, that's fine. almost want to just like no just let it go let it go so I forgot to mention that my one of my favorite shows is coming back on Wednesday so I don't know if you watch or you've heard of the hundred and it's on the CW and here's the thing I'm a, an adult <laughs> I'm an adult but I don't, there's just something about CW shows. Like, I think they get a lot of flack, and people think, oh, if something's on the CW, it must be made for kids. I can't speak for all shows that are on the CW, but, you know, I was a big fan, excuse me, I am a big fan of the Veronica Mars series. Um, that could get dark. I watched a couple seasons of Gossip Girl, I know that can get dark. Um... But yeah, I love The 100. It's so good. It's this dystopian, futuristic, sci-fi masterpiece, I think. And I don't think it gets enough credit because people see it on the CW and they think, oh man, it's for kids. But um, that's not true. It's not. So... Let's see. Oh, crud. Let's see. I'm I'm not used to doing this. You know, I'm still working out, planning, and trying to film. But I'm trying to, like, see what I want to do. Hold on. So what I was thinking about doing is using this Planner Kate date header thing. So my dog is in here now, and so if you hear a gremlin, that is my child, my Boston Terrier. So, this is the 17th. What is today? So I will come back when this is finished. Ugh. So, let's see. Today is Monday, and Monday already happened. Um, I took my dog, so I worked. It felt so long today. Um, and then after dinner, I took my dog to the park. My dog loves the park. And he gets so excited. There's, there's a few people there. It wasn't, like, too crowded. But it was just nice to get out after sitting all day. My goal, one of my goals is to take him to the park at least twice this week. And the reason why is because I do not live in a very uh, pedestrian-friendly area. And so if I want to walk my dog um, and I'm home, I have to physically drive somewhere to walk him safely. Um, so, that's that. 
Um, let's see. Tomorrow I have a few meetings that I have to attend. And I don't know what I'm doing yet after work. Um, Wednesday I have a few things uh, that I have to do for my personal life. Um, including going to that alpaca tour. Oh! Oh, I forgot! I know it's going here. How could I forget? Um, what's it called? So, let's see. Which box should I use? I'm just gonna, I'm gonna make my own box. So, um, what's it called? Like I said, Wednesday is the season premiere, one of my favorite shows. And I'm going to do the alpaca tour. Thursday. So I, I, um, you may or may not know of the website Yelp that does reviews. And anyway, if you do it long enough or you post enough reviews, you can be invited in your region to be part of the Yelp Elite. And I've been a Yelp Elite, I think 11 years now? I think it's been 11 years. Um, which is like one of the longest things I've ever done. And so last week I had a Yelp Elite event where, um, and these are over Zoom, I should mention. These are over Zoom, they're virtual because of the, the world events right now. But last week was a Yelp Elite event where the, um, it was like, bring your favorite cocktails to the Zoom. Um, and there was a mixologist and he talked about how to elevate your cocktail game while in quarantine, um, which was fun. And then this event that's happening this week over Zoom is a chef is coming. I think there's a list of ingredients that um, they sent out, um, but basically it's kind of like a cook-along class. I'm actually not going to be cooking along because my computer, I don't have a laptop, so my desktop's here. And I've tried to zoom over phone and it's not my thing. So, but yeah, she's going to teach us how to like make really delicious gourmet treats uh, at home. So that's going to be fun. So that's Thursday. Um, and then over the weekend, I didn't even realize until today that it's Memorial Day weekend coming up. That's how far from everything my brain is. So I didn't realize that it was... Um, Memorial Day weekend. Usually I would try to make plans, um, but I do have friends who want to social distance in their backyard. So they want to like invite only like like 10 people over max. Um, they have a big backyard. Um, I, it might even be less than 10 people, um, but it's just going to be like we're all going to be socially distanced and my friends all have children so they take this you know, super serious, um, as well as I do, um, but my friend said, you know, there's going to be guidelines and, you know, like plenty of cleaning materials and we're, we're going to stay, um, far apart, um, they're going to space out the chairs, um, but we're going to have like a, a bonfire and everything, but socially distance, so, um, and wear a face mask and whatever, so I'm looking forward to that. Um, yeah, and so I'm going to go in now, um, off camera and fill in some other stuff but uh, this was the gist of what I'm going to do on camera um, excuse me my messy desk but um, I just wanted to use this beautiful llama weekly kit since I had it in honor of the alpaca virtual for farm tour that I will be doing on Wednesday after work so, um, if you liked this video or found any information helpful, please think about giving this video a thumbs up and subscribing. Um, and until next time, I hope you guys all stay well. Bye!